The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on, guys? Clickwood here, back with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. And guys, today we have our new flashbacks coming into the game. We've got a right outside linebacker, Kiko Alonso. This is a flashback from when he was on the Buffalo Bills. It's a 2013 Week 4 card. Pretty damn good right outside linebacker card. Compares actually very, very closely to the Thomas David. Uh, Thomas Davis, excuse me, uh, limited time card that came out. That was a team of the week. If you go in here and take a look at this thing, this was from week nine, a couple of weeks back. Uh, if you compare the actual attributes on the Thomas Davis to the Kiko Alonso, they're almost identical in almost everything. Uh, the only big difference is that the hit power is quite a bit higher on the Thomas Davis. Uh, and then obviously he also has better strength. Now Kiko Alonso does have him in a couple different areas, block shedding, acceleration, things like that. But I don't think it's really super substantial. So that's why Th Thomas Davis is a 92 overall, whereas Kiko Alonso is only a 91 overall. But still definitely a good card. Uh, flashbacks are always pretty expensive. So that'll probably be a pretty expensive flash back card uh, just because it's decent in its attributes um, and then obviously the other one here guys is probably the one people are more excited about I would say which is kind of weird because it's an offensive lineman but it's the new best center as far as overall goes in the game and that is a Max Unger week 14 throwback to 2012 again um, now this is when he was actually on the Seahawks now he is no longer on the Seahawks I believe he's still with the Saints um, they traded him I believe he was basically a heads up trade for Jimmy Graham ram um so yeah anyway that that is the upgraded max unger card pretty damn good 90 strength uh 88 for run blocking 92 for pass block i'd like to see the run blocking be a little bit higher on this but uh overall a really really good card um definitely one of the best offensive linemen in the game right now so uh that should be a pretty expensive flashback card as well it's cool to have these flashbacks come in every single week um i definitely like that they're adding them it would be in my opinion it would be kind of cool if they added some more more of them. I mean, they're only doing two a week and they're doing players that are in the game currently. So it's not like they have to buy additional rights to these guys. So uh, in my opinion, it would be cool to have a little bit more of these and make them maybe a little bit more common. That would be pretty nice, but you know, it's not, not up to me, but I want to hear from you guys. What do you think about these cards? Do you like them? Um, is Max Unger going to be your new center? If you're somebody that is looking at having the highest overall, or do you like Jason Kelsey or, or who do you like at center? And then at right outside linebacker, do you like like Kiko Alonso, or would you prefer like a Thomas Davis or a Demarco? Uh, excuse me, a Demarcus Ware or a Jadavion Clowney, somebody like that. Let me know in the comments section below, guys, what you think about these cards. Good luck pulling them, and I will talk to you guys again soon.